Okay guys, so today we are going to visit the historic area of Martin Luther King National Historic Site. And this is the birth home. It, no, not birth home, where he lived. And then, so we're going there, two and three. Everything is in one little area and this is his church. So let's go. This is downtown Atlanta. And everything is within walking distance. You park at the National Park and then it's free. The parking is free there. And that might be the only free thing that's gonna be here. And you just walk on, there's a little park for the kids. And I guess it's a little doggy area also. And here we are. Okay, so this is a home place, Sweet Auburn, for Martin Luther King Jr. This neighborhood meant many things he believed here, ministered, it's kind of hard to read, ministered here and he would come to lead a great human movement from here in his youth. It was a vital community. Uh, cannot read that. Here Martin Luther King Jr. learned about the pain of discrimination, the virtue of commitment, and the power of ideals. It's kind of hard to read. They need to clean that up a little bit, but you got the message. And there's a little park. Okay, guys, we are guys. We are at the visitor center, and this is Mr. Gandhi. Civil Rights Walk of Fame. And those are there, and I will, once we leave, I will show you guys that. It's pretty interesting. A lot of stuff to read and learn. Okay. Now. Auburn Avenue Historic District. Miss Coretta. What does it say building closed? Maybe this side? Yeah. Oh, this is the back side? This is the visitor center. This is closed. A lot, some, a lot of things are still closed because of COVID. Oh. Like the national parks and... Okay. This is beautiful. Look at all the roses. I want a rose garden. We're going to the top right? Wherever. This is beautiful. I think they could keep it up a little bit nicer than it is right now, but this is beautiful. 
I have a dream world peace rose garden. Beautiful. Roses are beautiful. Oh my God. They need to clean it up though. Oh, I love this color. Okay, and that's the famous church over there. Ebenezer. <laughs> it's actually like surreal to know that. What went on here several years ago? Whose butt is that? Martin Luther King's butt? No. Oh, I was about to say, I, noticed. I didn't know he owned um, <laughs> African statue. Oh. Oh, it's a baby. I didn't see the baby's yeah. I thought that was Martin Luther King's posing naked. You sign up, probably sign up for me. Now, folks, that was not Martin Luther King. This is a sculpture commemorates the his heroic principles that guided the life and work of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. And this is the statue up close and in person. Beautiful. Look at those abs. Him and his wife are there. Oh, the, he's in there? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. This Welcome is beautiful. Visitors are not allowed in the pool. <laughs> Why would somebody want to go in the Welcome pool? Welcome to the King Center. Visitors are not allowed in the pool. This is where they lay. Martin Luther King and Coretta Scott King. Free at last, free at last, thank God Almighty, I am free at last. And now abide, faith, hope, love, these three things, but the greatest of these is love. In school, and it's cool to see it a person. This is really beautiful. Let's go this way. Like a mighty stream. This is really beautiful. We will not be satisfied until justice rolls down like water and righteousness like a mighty stream. And it flows down. This is amazing. If you've never been here, folks, I'm telling you, make this a once in a lifetime trip, Atlanta, and you just to see and understand some of the struggles. Yes, we read it in textbooks and everything, but I think it's different walking the streets, seeing the home he uh, grew up in or lived in, the church. This is really awesome. It's all in walking distance of each other. It's a pretty nice setup. Really nice. Okay guys, so this kind of sucked because the museum is closed, I guess because it's free and COVID is closed, so that's kind of disappointing. But we're gonna head on to his house. We cannot tour the house, we cannot tour the house, but we can see the house. Brother, come here. So this, so this area provided a training for them for social. Okay, and this is the historical fire station within this area. Not sh I'm pretty sure it's not um, it's probably not even open where we could tour it. Yep, 1894. So, come on, y'all. Building closed. Yes, everything is closed. So we're just 
basically walking the streets, seeing what's here. National Park. Let's see if we can see inside. Oh, wow. And that's just a little peek of inside. All of these are original historic homes. Yeah, there's people living in them now. And this is the home where he was born. It's beautiful. It's huge. Wow. Please do not lean or sit. Built in 1895. And it was purchased by, let's see, by his grandfather. So we can, I guess, watch the video later. Oh, wow. It's closed, but yeah, I, I know. There's stuff inside you can't really see. It is a nice house. This is amazing, being able to come here. And just, oh, look at that view though, that's amazing. No, the houses is just a nice little setting for back in the day. I appreciate things like this. Excuse me. So we're gonna go across the street and these are also some more historical houses. Huh? Oh, there's some up there too. No, let's just go. I want to see these. I would think that they would. Oh yeah. I would think that they wouldn't allow people to live in some of these historical homes. I know that there was plans for a greater renovation. Telling you about the birthplace for his family and the home. Okay, guys, so came to Atlanta and look what I don't know what kind of spider that is. Why didn't jump? Oh, oh, is he moving? I know, why is it not focusing? Focus. Okay guys, this is a little walk of fame. Frank jo Judge Frank Johnson, Jimmy Carter. This is President Jimmy Carter's footprint. I'm only gonna tell you the people I know. Lyndon Johnson, he's right there. Thurgood Marshall, right here. Gonna walk in his footsteps. Then you have Miss Rosa Parks. She has some tiny feet. Okay, I don't know. On the, a lot of these people I don't know. And there's some on the other side also. Okay, this is Desmond Tutu, Archbishop. Let's see. Stevie Wonder. There we go. Lena Horne, Sydney Pattier, oh, 
Let's see. This is really nice. Okay, guys, so I hope you enjoyed this mini tour. So sorry, everything was closed due to COVID, but it's okay. This is something I must go to see again. Um, we don't live in the area, but this is going to be on my bucket list to visit once everything opens back. Thank you for all your support. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And we just wanted to do a little family vlog on just some different activities that we enjoy. Bye.